Hey there everyone, welcome back to the channel. Using your Mac throughout time can cause a battery draining issue. Usually after a thousand circle charge, your battery starts to lose its strong ability. But still, with the help of tweaking up some setting and process will help you to solve your battery draining issues. Often battery draining issue can go really bad for faulty application, update, software malfunction, and more. Therefore, we're gonna give you an easy way to solve your problem once for an all. So, let's check it out. Alright guys, now to solve your problem, the first and foremost things we're gonna talk about is your brightness level either for your display and your keyboard. If you're using your full brightness on your Mac, especially for your keyboard and your display, for getting better visibility, this can often better drain on your Mac. So, all you can do, you can click on right here, and then you can click on your display, and then you can simply adjust it the way you want, or you can click on your Apple logo, come down to your system preference, and now go to your display. Now, once you come right here, and then you can automatic, you can simply turn these two features on called automatic adjust uh, brightness and true tone. So your Mac will automatically adjust the brightness level depending on the situation. And you can do exactly the same thing on your keyboard's brightness light. Okay, so if you tap right here, then you'll be able to find out the brightness level on your keyboard. Now just go ahead and tap on this arrow icon and then just put it down, especially if you're not using it at the daytime. Once you've done that, now let's go ahead and talk about the next way to solve your battery draining issue. And the next things we're going to talk about is your Bluetooth, Wi-Fi and your eardrop. As you can tell, these three options always turned on no matter what. So if you don't especially use your Wi-Fi, Bluetooth and AirDrop, then we highly recommend you to turn them off. Well, that will stay your battery a little longer than usual. Now, once you've done that, now let's go ahead and talk further on how you can save your battery more. Now, if you click on your Finder and go to your application, and now please take a look at the application you don't use at all. Okay, now often keeping too many applications on your M1 Mac can cause a serious battery draining issue. And choose that application, you simply can drag that application down and you can move them to the trust and then you'll be able to delete them, okay? Now, once you've deleted your application and you're still experiencing the same issue with your battery, then you can check out the next way, which is the notifications. Now, if you go to the notification center by clicking on your Apple logo, by going on to the system preference, now head over to your notification and focus and take a look at this application. If you don't find any application from here that is not useful to you, you can turn off the notification, okay? And then turning off this notification will help you to save your battery. Well, not as all be a battery draining issues further, the next things you have to check is your timer for your display and the low power mode, okay? Now if you click on your Apple logo here and go to your system preference, and now down here click on your battery once you open up your battery now click on your battery here and now here you're gonna see two options first you're gonna see the display that goes after okay now if you set it up let's say for never or three hour so this is definitely gonna cause your battery draining issue so we highly recommend you to put it either 15 minutes or about 20 minutes which is you know much better for everybody so you can choose it between you know 15 and 20 minutes and next things you just want to go ahead and take a look at is the low power mode okay now if your battery is just extremely getting bad let's say you are joining it super fast super quick you can turn this on okay so automatically it will help you to save your battery as long as it possible for your M on Mac okay now the last things you can do to solve your problem is to update your Mac to the latest software version to solve your problem now if you click on your Apple logo go to your about this Mac and then click on software update if you're gonna find out the new software available go ahead and click on update now and your software will start updating and your problem will be solved and your battery will stay much longer than before okay so these are the ways you guys can follow on your M1 Mac with macOS Monterey to solve your battery draining issues on your Mac hope you find this video really useful if so drop a like and subscribe to the channel thanks for watching and I'll talk to you later